Hey, I um, <clears throat> just want to give you a thought for going into the new year, make it more meaningful. Um, everybody knows the beginning of the Torah, which starts with uh, the line in the beginning. Uh, Hashem created the uh, the, 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 the skies, or the Shemaim, and, and the arts, the, 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 the heavens and, and, and the land. Um, the word Hebrew, Bereshit, is actually, it's, it's a compound word. The bet in front of it is actually, we trans what's commonly uh, translated as in, but it actually has other meanings as well, and that is how it relates to Rosh Hashanah. Um, bet also can mean with. So the concept is that the world was created with beginnings, meaning it's you're you're always able to begin again anew. You can always wherever you are, you can always start and refresh. There's a special power that happens in Rosh Hashanah, where the world is actually being recreated again. And the mystics say there's actually a time during the the the, the 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 holiday when actually the world ceases to exist and then gets recreated for a split second. Everything goes away and comes back, and we're completely unaware of it. So fast, bam. So we have a special power to make ourselves whatever we want. So go into the holiday knowing that, that you can be whoever you want to be. Um, and that's where the chauffeur ties in. The chauffeur is actually the sound beyond sound. It's a prayer with no words. It's when you, if you're going to do, get to a synagogue, which I really encourage you to do, go listen to the chauffeur and don't think of anything. Just let the sound come through you. It's the highest level of, 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 of meditation, the highest level of prayer. Have a wonderful Happy, sweet new year, and we should all be blessed to, for, for revealed good throughout the year.